Glaciology refers to the study of glaciers and the cryosphere in general. But how does the cryosphere respond to and drive global warming? Well, The main motivation many of us have for studying glaciers and the Greenland and Antarctic ice sheets is that they grow and shrink in response to climate change. In the present generally warming climate across the Earth, most glaciers and the large ice sheets are diminishing, either by melting or by carving icebergs into the ocean. Since 1900, sea levels have risen by 15 centimetres and are presently rising by 3 millimetres per year. In the last century, these contributions came largely from melting alpine glaciers. But in the future, they will come from the retreating Greenland and Antarctic ice sheets. It's critical that we understand how rapidly warming temperatures will cause the ice sheets to retreat, to plan flood defences around the world. The cryospheric response is also important, as glaciers can provide sources of irrigation, hydroelectric power and drinking water, as well as being significant hazards in the form of glacier outburst floods and avalanches. Time's nearly up, so one final thought. Global temperatures are rising, glaciers and ice sheets around the world are shrinking, and global sea levels are rising in response. These are facts. They are not causes for panic, as the rates are quite slow. But anyone living close to the sea, and that's 90% of the world's population, needs to plan ahead.